Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing? Good morning, Marie, Sandy, Cynthia. I see everyone. Great. We'll just wait a couple more minutes. So how's everyone's week? Pretty good. Everyone's hanging in. <laughs> okay. How's your foot? A lot better. A lot better. So I can definitely perform, um, demonstrate a few more exercises for sure today. It's Great. still uh, a little tender, but nowhere near last week. Got it. Good. Thanks Glad for asking. <laughs> All right, guys, so I guess we'll start. So if everyone wants to mute their mic just in case. Okay. Okay. All right, everyone. So hopefully uh, everyone has their water, their towel next to them. Any, we're going to be doing a little bit of upper body too. So we can have, you can have a small weights or not. It's totally optional. Okay. So we're all going to start on our backs. And let's just take a few breaths, inhale and exhale. Just a couple of breaths. Nice big inhale, filling up the lungs. Exhale, all that old air. Another big inhale, filling the lungs, and then exhale, all that old air. We're going to start with elbow circles, taking our hands, grabbing our elbows. We're going to circle. 10 times in one direction. And then we're gonna, when we're finished at 10, in that one direction, we're gonna go to the opposite direction. Starting to warm up the shoulders, a bit of the chest. Three, and then we're going to go into the opposite direction. Really opening up as much as you can. Continue. And as soon as you're finished, your circles, we're going to release our elbows and go into puppet arms. So let's do staggered arms. First, the right and then back down, then the left. Let's go for 10. And when you're finished, you're 10, staggering the arms. We're going to do both arms at the same time for another 10. Very good, guys. Continue to breathe.
really extending those fingertips to the sky. And as soon as you're finished, puppet arms with both arms together, let's have those hands placed back on either side of our bodies. Inhale, the knees into your chest, nice gentle hug, and let's just rock left and right just a little bit. And then slowly take the hands. We're going to go into spinal twist, allowing those legs to melt over to your right. Couple of breaths here. And when you're ready, windmill the legs over to the other side. We're going to do two on each side. So do what's comfortable. Stay a little bit longer or not on each side, but two. And as soon as you're finished doing two on both sides, have your feet in tabletop position. We're going to do toe taps. You're going to give me 10. Single. One, two, three. Good. Four, five, six, seven. Good, guys. Eight. And students, we're finished doing single. We're going to do both for 10. Pressing the hands into the palm, your palms into the mat. That's it, guys. And then from there, we're going to go straight into heels, single heel taps. Very good. That's it, Adam. I can see that's good, Cynthia, Sandy, Marie. Very good. Pressing those hands into the mat. And then from the, when we do both our heels, from single heel taps to both our heels, then let's grab those knees into our chest and give ourselves a little bit of hug. Very good. And then from there, let's have our palms back onto the mat. Let's extend our feet up into the sky, into our Pilates V. We're going to do froggy press. So let's pump the knees in and back out for 10. Two, three, four, good. Five, keep going. Six, making sure those heels are together. Eight, nine and 10 from there, then we're going to also do open our open leg frog press. So out for one, two, three, four, give me 10. Keep breathing guys. And then when you're finished 10 in that direction, we're gonna go into the opposite direction. Continuing to breathe, making sure those shoulders aren't creeping up towards your ear. And as soon as you're finished, bring those legs together, slowly exhale. Any lower back problems, you can bend the knees back onto the mat. Then we're going to slowly from here do roll ups. We're going to do six. So slowly inhale, coming all the way up, toes are flexed, heels into the mat, and roll yourselves up. And slowly roll yourself back down. Give me six, guys. That's it. Very good, Sandy. Good, Marie. That's it, Cynthia. That's it, Adam.
And on your last roll up, when you're up, we're going to then slowly stack the spine all the way up, opening our legs into saw. So that's the next exercise we're going to do. Slowly extend the hands opposite direction. Give me 10. And then back up, stacking the spine. Back up to center. Give me 10, guys. Making sure those toes are pointing up to the sky. And then from there, so we'll have our spines stacked again. Bring the feet together, hands in front. Let's do a forward uh, stretch. Toes are pointing up to the sky and grabbing for whatever is available to you guys. So if it's the calf, that's fine. Go a little deeper. Grab the ankle a little deeper. Grab the, the, the flesh of your feet and then slowly pressing down, making sure the toes are pointing up to the sky, leading with the chest. So not so much the neck, you're leading with your heart, breathing into it. Toes are flexed. Let's stay here for a couple of breaths. And then let's slowly stack our spine, hands in front, and then roll ourselves back down onto the mat. Lower your tailbone, your middle back, letting the head be the last thing to hit the mat. You can bring those knees in to your chest, but let's open your knees a little wider and then rock back and forth, just massaging the lower back a little bit. A couple of breaths here. Josh is kind of a D, D minus player. Um, and then let's slowly bring back the, the feet together, letting the left leg hit onto the mat, extending the right foot up into the sky, toe pointed. Let's do single leg circles. Give me 10 in one direction. As wide as you can go without the hip moving. So stabilize your hips. So the circles don't need to be as big guys. And we're going to do 10 in one direction. And then when you're finished the 10 in that direction, we're going to go into the opposite direction. Very good guys. And as soon as you're finished with your right leg, we start again with the left leg. Making sure those hips are not moving all over the place. They're stabilized. Crossing a little bit more, if you can, each time over your opposite leg. And then we go into the opposite direction. Very good, guys. Continue to breathe. And soon as we're finished, allow that leg to match your other leg onto the mat. And then slowly bring both legs up. Let's give ourselves a little hug. Bring those knees into your chest. If you feel you need to rock left and right, that's totally fine, or just stay centered. From here, we're going to go straight into our 100. So again, you can have your feet at 45 degree or fully extended into your Pilates V. Slowly inhale, lifting the body, and start pumping your arms. One, two, three, four, five. Exhale, one, two, three, four, five. Inhale. Exhale. Very good, guys. Continue to breathe. 
Again, any pressure on that lower back, bring those knees, your legs down. Continue to breathe, guys. Very good. Continue to breathe. More than halfway through right now. It, guys almost there and one two three four five and from there bring those knees into your chest and give yourself a little bit of love excellent And then from here, we're going to extend our left leg, getting ready for single leg stretch. Give me 10, guys. One, two, right here. Give me 10. And then from here, as soon as you're finished, you're 10. Have our feet extended. We're going to do our double leg stretch. Extending out. Give me 10. Really feeling each inhale and exhale. Very good, guys. And as soon as you're finished your 10, we're gonna hang right here. Hold for 10 more seconds, pulsing the arms right here. Just give me a pulse. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Bring those knees into the chest. Getting ready for crisscross, which is, which is our bicycle. You guys, you guys are gonna give me 10. Extending, hands behind the nape of your neck. Cross. Give me 10. Two. On your last 10, you're gonna hold right here. Give me 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, as much as you can. Two and one. Extend. Opposite side. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bring those knees back into your chest. A little bit of a stretch right here. Extend now the, your legs all the way down into the mat. If you need to bend your knees, that's totally fine. Let's have those feet flexed to the sky. We're going to slowly roll ourselves all the way back up. Making sure now we slowly stack our spine. Let's do rolling like a ball. So bringing our feet together, grabbing the shin. You guys are going to give me 10, okay? So big chest right here. Then you're going to slowly inhale, scooping the belly, rolling like a ball. Give me 10, two. Very good, guys. That's it, Marie. Very good, Cynthia. That's it, Sandy. Good, Adam. And as soon as you finish your 10, we're going to balance. Try to have those toes up as much as you can. Balancing. We're going to do 10 seconds here. We already did six, five, four, three, two, one. Then slowly roll yourself back onto the mat, extending those legs out in front of you. Let's also, if you need to, we can bring our feet back up, grabbing the inside of our knees, and then slowly just open. And let's just rock a little bit, massaging the lower back. Bring
bringing the legs together. Let's go on to our side. Let's mix it up just a little bit. So making sure our feet come a little bit more stacked in front of us. If you guys need to take a water break, drink some water, get a towel off for a bit, that's totally fine. Just to make sure you guys can see me. So making sure the legs, again, a little bit of a V here, like an angle, making sure that your shoulder is not stank, stacking in towards your other shoulder upright. And let's start with 10, two, uh, three, four, abs are engaged, five, six, that's it guys, seven, eight, nine, and 10. We're gonna hold right here. Give me 10 circles in one direction, and then we're gonna do 10 in the opposite direction. Very good, guys. Continue to breathe. And as soon as we're finished 10 in one direction, we're gonna go into the opposite direction. Making sure the abs are still engaged. We're not sinking into that shoulder. And as soon as we're finished right here, hang in there, guys. We're gonna bring that knee in towards our chest and back up for 10. Two, three, keep going. Five, good, good, good. Six, seven, eight, nine, and 10, and right here, hang on there guys, give me little knee circles, right here, 10, nine, eight, hang in there, seven, six, abs are still engaged, four, three, two, and one, opposite direction, 10, nine, eight, seven, continue to breathe, six, five, good, four, three, two, and one, excellent. Nice extend. Let's go on two. Let's give ourselves a little bit of a stretch here. We're gonna do the other side. Just to stretch out that leg that you worked right here to the side. A little bit of a stretch. And then let's prepare ourselves. When you're ready, guys, finish the other side. So again, making sure, guys, that you're not sinking into that shoulder upright. Legs extend in that V. Let's do 10. Very good. Four. Very good. And hold up. We're going to do our 10 circles. One direction. And as soon as you're finished at 10, we go into the opposite direction. Very good, guys. That's it, Maureen. Very good, Sandy. That's it, Adam. Cynthia, very good. Everyone's doing good. And then from there, we hang on. We're going to bring that knee back into our chest and back up. Give me 10, two, three. Really kicking, extending through that heel. And on the last one, hang in there guys, we're gonna do those circles. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, then the opposite direction. 10, nine, keep breathing. Eight, seven, six, abs are engaged, making sure that your body's still upright. Two and one, excellent. Let's go into, into our tabletop position here. 
but go back into a child pose just to stretch out your buttocks just a little bit. So sit into that side, just stretch it out a little bit. Leaning into it, breathe, filling up your lungs. And then let's come on up to our tabletop position. If you guys need to drink some water, that's fine. If not, we're gonna continue. Tabletop position, let's do cat and cow. Inhale, scooping the belly. And then exhale out. Let's do eight, making sure the palms are right under your shoulder. Really all the way, scooping the belly. Exhale. And as soon as we're finished, we come back into neutral spine, alternating our arm and leg, extending the left arm, right leg up, and then bringing it in. Give me 10, guys. And on the last one, while we're here, let's hold. Another 10 seconds, five is gone already. Four, three, two, and one. Let's bring it in. Slowly going right into that opposite leg again and bringing that knee in. Inhale, exhale. Really extending through the fingertips and the feet, guys. Very good. And then on our last one, our 10, we're gonna hold out. Eight, seven, six, hang in there. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it in, let's go into a child's pose. Press into the palms, big inhale and exhale. And then let's come back up into tabletop position. And we're gonna do some donkey kicks. You guys gonna give me 10? All the way up for one. Two, straight out. Three. Very good, guys. Making sure we're not sinking into that opposite arm. Soon as we finish our 10 right here, we're gonna go right into clamps, right here. Fire hydrant, sorry. Two, three, four, five. Really press into your palms, guys. We're doing 10 right here. Nine and 10 from right here. Hang in there, give me some circles. Three, four, five. Hang in there, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, opposite direction. Hang in there, breathe. Hang in there, then we're gonna straighten the leg and then almost touching the mat, then back up for one. So straight leg kicks right here. Two, three, four, five. Five more guys, five, four, Three, two, and on the last one, let's hold it right here. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it in, sit it back, stretch it out a little bit. Everyone's doing great, fantastic. And then let's come right back up to tabletop position. We're gonna do the opposite leg. 
All right. Give me 10 donkey kicks. Two. Three. Abs are engaged. Four. Really extending through that feet. Good guys. Four. Three. Two. And one. Then right into we're gonna do our fire hydrants. So one. That's it. Two. Abs are engaged, guys. Three. Four. Good. Five. Five more. Four. Three. Two. And don't hold your breath. Right here. We're gonna go into those circles. Ten circles. And it doesn't need to be big. It's all about the quality of the exercise, guys. Everyone's doing good. Hang in there. Three more. And then we're going to go into the opposite direction. Ten. Nine. Breathe into eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Then straighten that leg. Then we're going to do all the way ten more. Almost touching the, the ground. And up for one, two, three. Abs are engaged. Four. Try not to sink into that opposite side. Four, three, two. And on your last one, let's hold it right here. Ten seconds. Eight, seven. Breathe into it. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring that knee down. Let's go into a child's pose. If you want a deeper stretch, widen your knees, guys. And then really sit back into your heels and extend those fingers all the way in front of you, pressing into the palms and allowing your chest to start melting in between your arms towards the mat. Let's take a couple of breaths here. Nice big inhale, filling up the lungs, exhaling it all the way out. And as we're here, let's do thread the needle. So let's just slowly halfway come back up. Let's take inhale that left hand all the way up. Exhale, let it melt through as much as you can through the other arm, breathing into it. And then inhale all the way up. Exhale here. Inhale, opposite arm. And then slowly exhale, allowing as much as you can that shoulder to hit to the mat. Continue to breathe, really feeling a nice stretch. Very good, guys. Good work. And then from there, Slowly come back up in the tabletop position. Let's just do a couple of more cat and cows while we're here. Inhale. Exhale all the way out. Let's just do one more, guys. Really over-exaggerate. Really scooping, scooping, scooping the belly. Exhale all the way out. And then coming back up into neutral spine. Let's go back onto the mat. Actually, sorry guys, let's do upper body while we're here. Let's continue. So we're not moving all around the place. So grab your weights if you have any, if you wanna use some. Just gonna provide a little bit more padding for my knees here. And you don't have to have weights either, guys, okay? So let's first start with serving brownies, serving the platter. We're going to do 10. Two. All the way up. Three. Making sure those shoulders aren't creeping up towards your ears. Abs are engaged. Five more. Three. Two. And one. Then from here, we're going to go straight into some bicep curls. Right here. Two. Abs are engaged. Three. Good. 
Good, good, good. Seven. Eight. Full extension. Nine. And ten. And from here, have our palms in front of us like this. We're going to do ten for our shoulder curl right up in here. Shoulder cuff. Give me ten. Very good. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Then from here, have your palms facing me, guys. We're going to do some shoulder press right here. Ten. Nine, bringing those elbows all the way down. Six, good. Five, full extension. Four, three, two, and one. Bring them down. Extend those palms all the way straight. Palms are facing the sky. We're going to do 40 circles right here. Three, four, five. Six. If, you, if it's in you today, guys, you can go bigger with the circles or small. Just making sure those shoulders aren't e itching up towards your ears. They're melted down. Abs are engaged. 20, 21. Hang in there, guys. 22, 23, 24. We can even start to move the arms a little bit. 30, 31, 32. Keep going, guys. 36, 37, 38, 39, and four. Let's continue if you can. Now the palms are facing the earth. Let's do another 40 right here. Three, four, good. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's do it, guys. I'm feeling it too a little bit here. 19, 19, 20. We got 20 more. Thirteen, hang in there. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Before you drop it, just hang right here. Give me ten seconds right here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Two more exercises. We gotta do a little bit of triceps. So I'm gonna turn to the side. All right, let's do kickbacks right here for 10, nine, eight. Only the forearms are moving. So our elbows are glued to our side. And as soon as you're finished, you're 10. We're gonna hold it and pulse it for 10 more. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one, and the last one is going to be our back rows. Up for one. Up for two. Really feel that extension through your arms, guys. Three. Long arms and row it back up. Five. Five more. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Great work. Let's toss those. Let's do a little bit of a stretch. Crossing the arm. Over. Nice big inhale, exhale. And then let's do the opposite arm. And then let's take the other arm. Let the other, your forearm just melt much as you can if there today i'm going to show you guys and just breathe into it pressing the elbow don't use too much force just opening up the chest feeling a nice stretch along the side of your body here and then when you're ready we're going to do the same thing on the opposite side allowing the elbow behind the, your head Feeling a nice stretch all along the side of your body right here, guys. A couple of more breaths right here. Now, positive earnings, um, you know, uh, you know, next few years. And then let's roll the shoulders all the way up. Exhale, let them melt. Another big inhale. 
and exhale. Excellent. Let's get onto the mat. We're going to go into our shoulder series. If you need to grab some water, towel off. So let's bring those heels towards our buttocks. Palms are onto the mat. And let's, on the next back, inhale, inhale. And then exhale, bringing the buttocks all the way up. Extend the leg up to the sky. Give me 10 right here. One. And then two. And three. Four. Five. We're going to do 10. Eight. Nine. And hold your 10 right up here. We're going to do pulses right here. Give me 10. Nine. Eight. Good work, guys. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one, hang in there, guys, with that same leg up into the sky. Give me 10 little circles right here. If it's a little bit too much and you can bring the leg down, bend your knees and give me your circles right here. But the main thing is keep your, your pressing into the opposite leg. Keep your butt up as much as you can. Then into the opposite direction. Six, five, four, three, Two and one. Bring the buttocks down. We can bring our knees into our chest a little bit. Take a couple of breaths right here. And then we're going to do the same thing on the opposite side. So feet, again, shoulder width apart. Inhale, exhale, all the way up. Extending the leg up to the sky, almost touching the mat. Give me the shoulder right here. Two, three, four. That's it, guys. Five, six, good. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Keep it up. Let's pulse it right here for ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, keep going, four, three, two, one, and give me some circles. Right there, guys, 10 little circles. Very good, Cynthia, good, Adam. Hang in there, guys. That's it, Sandy, pressing into the palms. Good, Marie. When you're finishing one direction, we go right into the opposite direction. Making sure you're not holding your breath. And as soon as we're done, drop the buttocks and come back down. Bring those knees in towards your chest. A little bit of a stretch right here. We're gonna continue, allow those feet to land onto the mat, still shoulder. We're gonna go into our shoulder bridge, but only pulses. So we're gonna inhale all the way up, squeeze your butt here, then slowly allow it to come back down. Give me 10, two, three. Really squeeze your butt, guys. When you're up, four. It. Two. On the last one, we're going to hold right here for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. While we're still, we're going to keep up here, guys. We're going to do some clams. Hang in there. Give me, two. we're going to do 10. Nice and wide. Seven, six, five, breathe into it, guys. Four, three, two, we're gonna hang up here. 
from here, continue helm with your shoulder bridge. We're going to drop one leg up for one single side clam. Two. We're going to do 10 on each side. Five. Six. Hang in there. Seven. Eight. Nine. Then the other side. Drop it as low as you can go. Three. Four. Six, seven, keep breathing. Eight, nine, and 10. Come back to center, slowly drop your butt. Then let's bring those knees into our chest and give ourselves a little bit of love. And then let's slowly just extend the legs all the way, straighten them down onto the mat. And then we're gonna slowly roll ourselves all the way up. Exhaling all the way over like our roll up. And then slowly come back up to stacking our spine. We're gonna do spine stretch now, guys. So let's widen the feet. Make sure you guys can see me. So again, this is different from our roll up. Hands extended in front of us. Our feet are a little wider than the mat. But then we're going to slowly think of your, your curving your body like a C. Extending, we're stretching the middle of the back. And then we're going to slowly come back up. The stacking the spine. Let's do six more. Making sure the feet are flexed. Really imagining and picturing your, your spine, guys, like a C. So scooping the belly. Just a couple more. Making sure the feet are flexed. Last one right here. Let it be your best. Then slowly come back up to stacking your spine. We're going to do spine stretch right here again. So let's bring the feet now together. Toes are pointing to the sky. We're going to pulse one, two, three to the side, back into the middle. Then again to the opposite side. Right, two, three, and then back up. Let's do that eight more times. Two, three. Good. Back up to the middle. And the last one on the other side, back up to center, hands are straight in front of you. Let's slowly roll ourselves back down onto the mat. And then we're going to roll ourselves over onto our bellies. Let's do a little bit of back extensions here. So we're going to have our, our our um, forehead placed on our forearms and having your feet just as wide as the mat and then we're going to slowly lift our upper body all the way up as much as you can we're going to do eight two really feel the extension guys three Five, that's it, six, keep going, seven, and then eight right here, and then slowly allow to come back onto the mat. Now we're going to include our legs. So let's do them together now for eight. So lifting both legs and your upper body, and then back down for one. Back up. And then down. 
two. Exhale, three. Four more, guys. Two. And don't hold your breath. And one. Back onto the mat. Let's extend now. Our arms in front of us. We're going to do alternate leg and arm. So now we're going to lift both our left arm and our right leg. And then back down. Making sure your neck is not moving though. So a nice straight spine. Four. Five. We're going to do ten in total, guys. And as soon as you finish your 10, on this side, we go straight into the other side. That's it, Cynthia. Very good, Sandy. That's it, Adam. Very good, Marie. Good. Everyone's taking a break. Really extending through the fingertips, guys. We're almost there. Three, two, and then one. And come back down to the mat. We're gonna do swimming for 10. So flood, flood, flood of the arms and your legs. Six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Excellent. Let's bring our bodies up and let's do a wide legged child's pose. So this will feel really good. Widen your knees as much as you can and then sink your buttocks all the way back as much as you can, going towards your heels and extending your fingertips all the way in front of you. Filling up your lungs. Nice big inhale and exhale. And as we're here, we could also, if it's available today, guys, move the arms just a little bit towards your right until you can go no further. And then you stop right there and then allow the chest to melt down towards the ground. Breathing here, filling up the lungs, feeling a nice stretch along the side of your body. And then let's slowly again, walking the hands as far as you can go and then allowing the chest to melt down onto the ground, feeling a nice stretch again along the opposite side of the body. And then let's come back up. And let's go back onto our backs. If you guys need to drink some water, that's fine. If not, we're gonna just finish up here on our backs. So having both our hands on either side of our hip, we're going to slow, if you have any type of lower back problems, you can start right here with bending your knees we're going to slowly inhale. We're going to do 10 lower leg lifts, but not touching the mat. So again, any lower back problems, bend the knees. If not, legs are straight into a Pilates V, almost, almost, almost touching the mat. We're going to be doing this very slow. Two. Three. Again, any lower back problems, bend the knees. Very good. Very slow and controlled. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. On the tenth one, we're going to hold right here and just do one leg at a time for ten. Breathe into the guys. Right there. Eight, seven. So if you're doing your Pilates V, 
you're matching your heel all the way up. If your knee is bent, you're matching it right where you're at, right there too. Hang in there, guys. Three, two, and one opposite leg now. One, two, breathe into it, guys. Three, four, five. An exercise like this, we want to go quicker, but it's very, as much, it's so important to go as slow as you can. No momentum. Almost there. Nine. Last one and 10. Excellent. Bring those knees into your chest. And you can roll on your lower back. Inhale, exhale right here. And as we're here, let's extend the left leg just onto the mat, holding onto the right calf. Making sure both shoulders are on the mat. Give yourself a nice little extra stretch here. Bring that knee in as much as you can towards your chest. Your resting leg that's on the mat for a little bit more of a stretch. Have that leg, the, the feet pointed up to the sky. Very, it's flexed. So we still are, have an active leg. Continue to breathe. And with each exhale, allowing the knee to come a little bit more towards the chest. And then let's switch legs. Again, that other leg on the mat, have the feet flexed to the sky. Really breathing. And then bringing both knees towards your chest. Let's do spinal twist again. Having both hands extended on the opposite side of your body, allowing the legs to melt over towards your right, and then you're looking towards the left. So you're picturing your body like you're wringing out a towel. So pressing that left shoulder into the ground. The left knee is pressing into your right. You guys gauge the intensity. And then let's windmill the legs onto the opposite side. Again, as much as you can. Right shoulder going towards the mat and the right knee pressing into the left. And then coming back up to center, extending those legs all the way in front of you. Having hands by either side of your body, let's roll the shoulders all the way up, inhale, and then exhale, allow them to melt. Let's do a few more here, inhale, and then exhale, allowing it to melt. One more time, rolling the shoulder all the way up, inhale, and exhale all the way out. You guys did great. <laughs> How does everyone feel? Good? A little bit? You guys are just a little warm? <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome, Adam. Bye. Have a good weekend. Bye. You guys have a great weekend. Bye. Thanks, Cynthia. Bye. Bye. Bye, Marie. Bye. Thank you. You're welcome.